Hi, this is David with entry number 64, um, coming at you on Sunday evening about 6 o'clock, yeah, maybe 5.50. Um, like I said, didn't really do much today. Did a lot of um, just laid back, relaxing, um, waking up so early yesterday. It took a lot out of me, um, a lot of walking and stuff. So, yeah, I was pretty tired. Um, was going to go to the beach to get some coffee, but, you know, just wasn't feeling it. I did go out to get groceries for the week, um, you know, just the typical stuff. Um, I got enough stew, though, so I don't need to make one tonight. Um, but, you know, all in all, it was good. My sink got clogged the other day, or the other week, last weekend. And so I've been using my kitchen sink, which is directly to your left. And um, um, so today I went out and bought um, some drain cleaner. And man, if you want to know like the most dangerous thing that most people have in their houses, I gotta say that drain cleaner stuff is some potent stuff. Like I'm pretty sure it's really basic, you know, the opposite of acidic, and it just destroys anything like organic. <laughs> um, I try, I wanted to, I did a little test where I put some in a little glass dish and I dropped a hair in it and man, it just like disintegrated. Um, but yeah, the drain was uh, freed up. I poured some boiling water down the drain and it just plopped open. Um, a really funky smell came out for a few hours though after I cleared it and that was uh, interesting. Um, other than that though, you know, it was normal. Um, yeah, today uh, the weather was pretty nice. Um, it stayed around, I think maybe the low 70s, so that was pretty good. Um, other than that, like I said, I didn't really do too much, so I'll keep this one short. About midday, excuse me. About midday, I um, I talked with my family for a while. Um, my mom and my dad. Um, yeah, it was. Uh, I think it was pretty late for them, maybe like nine or ten and um, at night and um, yeah it was nice catching up with them um, the whole thing with family here is um, you know since I don't have any uh, it's uh, I really appreciate the times when I get to talk with them it's been about a week so I really um, I like talking with them um, I miss my dog a lot and uh, every time I make sure that if my mom's home I make sure she shows me him because he's so big now I mean, he was full grown when he left, but when I think of him, I still remember him as just that little, you know, what was he, like an eight pound little puppy when we got him. Now he's like a 50 pound monster. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, I miss him. Um, it was really good, though, talking with family and kind of coming to some conclusions on, you know, whether or not the, you know, uh, I do have friends in talk, but most of them are in the southern region of Korea, which is a problem for me because I'm in the northern region. Um, and so it takes a lot to get me out there, or it takes a lot of work to get to them. Um, I'm not saying they're not worth it, but it's very hard um, for me to uh, to go down there. You know, every day that passes, though, is more motivation for me to go down there because there's nothing really here for me in um, or there's no one here for me in um, in Cognum. It's kind of me, myself, and I. The other talk scholars here have kind of I don't know if they've abandoned me per se, but they don't really hang out with me. Um, it seems like every time I reach out to them, they don't like they don't either want to or they can't or they make some excuse. You know whether or not it's valid is you know is um, beyond me, but. Um, they somehow don't ever have the time to meet up with me. Um, I realize that I can be a bit of a a tour de force when it comes to um, you know talking with me, but um, yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure what's going on, but I, I don't have anyone here to talk with. Um, the one the the do the the people I do speak English with um, that I find to get the most out of. Uh, our, our friendship is the Mormons because they're so um, 
open to talk about anything, and they're really, um, excuse me, they're really kind, and um, they don't really, you know, I know they have some, you know, an agenda, but it's, um, for those times when we're talking about just life in general, it's, it's very enjoyable for me, because not being able to speak English on a regular basis, I mean, conversational English, is a bit of a taxing uh, thing. But, uh, so, like I said, I'll keep this one a little short. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Tomorrow I do teach all four of my classes, kindergarten, first, fourth, and fifth. So I'll be sure to update you with uh, how that went. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.